Hello and welcome to another vlog of our stay here at Hoover and Bashley. Um, again, if you're new to the channel, then I'm Ryan and I'm Joe. He's Joe. Welcome to the channel. Um, if you've not subscribed, then please subscribe, like, do all that stuff. You you know what to do. The huge. The huge. Um, today it is absolutely beautiful. Clear blue skies. It's lovely. Um, so we are going to head down to Barton on the Sea, uh, which has a dog friendly beach, so we can take the pugs up onto the beach. And then we found a little kind of walk. Careful. The dogs can hear me say the W word. Hey, hey, um, around in a little spot around the New Forest, there's a nice little kind of little lake, river sort of thing. Um, potentially some horses, and we really want the pugs to see some horses because they go mental for them on the TV and we thought they need to see them in real life. So we thought we can do that. Um, so it's a little bit of a day out, enjoy the sunshine and see what's kind of around in the new forest. Let's go. So we've made it at Barton on the sea and well, Lovely. see for yourself. Look at that. Very nice. Very nice. The girls are enjoying it. That's pretty much you said that was the, That's the Isle of White because yeah. you've got the needles. Yeah. You picked a really perfect day because it's sunny, but it's not ridiculously scorching hot. So we're going to try and find a way down to the bottom and have a little wonder. Very pretty. Hi. Is you having fun sniffing? Yeah. You like Barton on the sea? Lovely. Yeah? Oh yeah, they fight in now, isn't it? I can't get over how nice it's though. So we're trying to work out, we think Bournemouth is like that way. Which we want to go to, but there's only certain parts of Bournemouth Beach that is dog friendly. Although the sandbanks you can take the dogs. So we might go there and then, oh, it's a bit breezy, but it's a nice breeze. I find it funny that I've been out there, like I've been on a thing. Oh, to the needles? Yeah, like I've been there. The last time I was there, the last time I've actually seen that in my life like that, I was... Younger? 10. <laughs> yeah, so like 21 years ago. Crazy. A long time. It's a long time. So we've had a walk along the beach. Although it's lovely for Joe and I. Daphne and Peg. Especially Peggy. He's not having any of it. She's a little bit warmer. <laughs> And as much as we tried to get her in the sea, she again is having none of it. Neither was that. Actually. But all she wants to do is run around. Yeah, it's she wants to run. Fun. She wants to run and they mm. chase each other, yeah. tire themselves out, get themselves overheated. So we just found a tap and we literally just diced them <laughs> in water. They're not, very <laughs> they're not, they're not the most intelligent of pugs. So we're going to head back to the car and then. There is a little kind of woodland walk that we want to do, which might be a little bit cooler for them and they can still have a run around. So we now have to walk up this hill. Oh, it reminds me of being at Simmons Yacht. <laughs> it might kill us, we'll see. We'll see if we make it to the top. We made it, we made it to the top. And the girls have called down now as well. And we think, yeah, there is. There's some shops. So we're going to stop in the shop and grab a drink. Look, oh, pretty little houses. Don't worry. You right now, girls? Yeah. You're good. Right, let's go in the shop. So we're back in the caravan 
We didn't go to the little woodland walk. Um, the pugs are hanging, so we are going to do that a little bit later. Once it's just cooled down a little bit because they're all black pugs. They get tired and hot. hot very, very quickly. We brought some, well, Joe brought a pretzel making kit, uh, which we got from Costco. Um, and I've got what, Girard Girardelli or Girardelli? Girardelli. Girardelli. Brownie kit. So we thought, well, while we're here, we'll make some. So we're going to do that. So come bake with us. And I'm not going to guarantee what this is going to turn out like, but hey, we'll give it a go. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll see how, how that turns out. Okay, and then so I'm making pretzels. I'm going to attempt a Mickey pretzel. It's probably not going to come out like a Mickey pretzel. It's probably going to come out some sort of dodgy looking shape. Um, yeah, so I've got my ingredients. They did come in a big box because they were like a multi-pack. I think there was like five packs in there or something like that. Um, and obviously because of the room in, car, room in the car, we didn't want to bring the massive boxes that they come in. Um, so I just took a screenshot of the introductions from the back of the box and grabbed a sachet each of what I need. Um, and I will show you, bear with. So yeah, as you can see, I took a screenshot of the ingredients there on my phone. That's some of the sachets that I needed. Unsorted butter, milk, wind scales, saucepan, and a measuring jug. First thing I need to do is get some unsorted butter, 35 grams and 175 ml of semi-skim milk. Okay, so I've measured out my butter and I'm just gonna quickly melt it in the frying pan. Okay, so got my milk, just need to add it in to the melted butter and then warm it just so it's past lukewarm. It shouldn't take too long. And leave to cool slightly. And then I need to empty one of the bags of flowers into that. Okay, so the milk and the butter are mixed together. It's lukewarm. And now I just need to add my flour. But first I'm gonna move the, uh, the milk and the butter into a different bowl just so we can add it all together and then just add my flour mix into my butter trying to do this with one hand is very awkward there we go in you go lovely lovely i have no idea how these are going to come out i hope they taste the right i hope they don't give us food poisoning or anything like that but we'll see and two right so i need the sugar, the yeast, and the salt, which are these three there. I think that's sugar, uh, salt, sugar, and yeast. How close? <laughs> oh, not come to you. I'm, I'm not the bloody, I'm not the food on display here. Right, next. Let's show the bowl. There you go. This is what it's all about. This is what they came here to see. So it says, Add Paul Hollywood here. No. Um, sugar, salt, and yeast. So that is the sugar. Lovely, lovely. Might need to put a bit more on that. A bit more sugar. More sugar. You can never have enough sugar, trust me. Uh, and then the salt. That is a lot of salt. It's a heart attack. We're waiting to happen. You like salt, though. I do like salt. But yeah. Um, and then some yeast. And now it says I need to mix, make a well, make a well. Yeah. Oh, yeah Are you not following the instructions? Yeah. <laughs> so I just need to mix. It Why all. do you need to make a well? Oh, God, I don't know. Just need to mix it all in together, like basically. So it makes like a dough consistency. Were you meant to make a, we a well and then pour in the liquid? I think I might have, yeah. Because <laughs> I don't think... <laughs> I can't cook. If 
anybody's watched our vlogs before. We did one years and years ago. I think it was like when we first kind of started out on it, right? Yeah. And we made pizza, and it just went. I just. <laughs> I made de- can you remember when I made the dough? Yeah. I didn't even make the dough. I just basically done what I've done now, and it just. But see, it's kind of it's doing all right. It's doing all right. Do you want me to quickly read the instructions? Well, it's a bit late now, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Bear with. No, let's not read the instructions because the instructions will prove that I have got it wrong. Right, right now. Yeah, but then I might no. be able to help you save it. <laughs> Right There's now, no saving this, Ryan. I, I, we might not have any press. Right now we have porridge. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> mm, porridge. It does look like porridge. It's fine. It just needs a bit of need in it. Just needs a little bit of love. The dogs will eat it. They don't care. It's bread. The dogs can't eat it. Right. Let's um. Let's just clear up all this mess a minute. I don't really know what to say, but. Keep watching because you never know what this is going to turn into. Um, just got to tip it out a minute because I think this is when I'm going to get ready to start kneading. This is when it's going to go gooey. Yep, I know. So let's get it out. <laughs> it's not going to come out, is it? It will, you just need to turn the bowl upside down and scrape it out. Like this? Yeah. Let it fall onto the surface. The flour's on there. Keep it... Yeah. Get all of that out. So you're going to need that now. <laughs> I'm going to need to try and salvage it, that's for sure. It will come together. I'm sure. Okay, so... I massively messed up. I don't know what I've done. I can't cook. I can't bake. I can't really do anything other than build Lego. Um, speaking of Lego, I am going to be building some Lego this evening because, um, yeah, I, I did some yesterday. I did my little castle. Uh, and now today I want to crack on with my uh, Harry Potter Collector's Edition Hogwarts Hegwit, Hedwig, Hegwit, Hedwig set. Um, yeah, so Ryan's just nipped to the shop because obviously I need more flour. I've, I'll show you what I've done. It looks a mess. I mean, I don't think the dogs would want to touch that. It It's just sticky as well. Um, and like I said, I'm out of flour. I have no more flour. It's sticky, and I can't get it off. So I can't get it off the side. Ryan's back. I'm back. He's got my flour. Got your flour. I bet that was cost you an arm and a leg, didn't it? It was only one pound something. One pound something for some flour. Um, I did grease my bowl. I don't know why it asked me to grease a bowl, but yeah, I'm gonna. Because you'll put that into that to let it rise. Okay, so let's try and salvage this now. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, I mean, finally got there. Now it's not sticky, and it looks like to uh, It's smooth, and it's elasticy. Yeah. So um, you, sir, are going in there. The dough is now proving. Um, it's currently in a bowl, just sitting in there. Yeah. See you in 90 minutes. The dough. You weighing the dough. Yeah, I'm just weighing it so it's they're roughly the same sort of size. It's not for you. Uh, uh, What's yes, the matter? Huh? What is it? What is it? Where's your sister? Sleepy? What are you doing? Why is you always sleepy? Huh? You tired? Right, now, so just for one night, my things, nearly there. So we'll come back when Joe's actually made his first one. <laughs> if that ever happens. <laughs> Thank you.
got his buns in the oven. My pretzels. Your pretzels. Yeah. They're not ready yet. They're not though. ready. They're almost. They're not quite done, but I'm just swapping them around just because the two. Oh, the look at that one. Yeah, they look okay. I mean, I'm not. I'm not a baker. I've never. I don't know what happened with that one. Yeah, I don't know. What happened with that one. <laughs> It's more like a bug. <laughs> some bug pretzel. <laughs> you got a bug pretzel? Yeah, yeah so look. I'll just swap them around, let the ones cook a bit. Um, and then I also bought this as well, because this is what happens when you go to America. You get like a little pot of cheese. Plastic. Stuff. Plastic. And yeah, so we bought one of these. Notice how it says cheese. cheese. Flavor. Yeah, it's not real cheese. What is actually in it? <laughs> so Joe's quickly washing up, but I've just given the dogs a little treat. These little homemade ice lollies. They so there's, them. they love these. Um, they're basically these ones are basically bananas, blueberries, strawberries, and Greek yogurt. Um, which they love and then these ones are strawberries cucumber mint and banana Is there any yogurt or anything like that in there's no yogurt in these ones yeah. yogurt in these ones but they love them but they're really cool to keep them nice and refreshed as you can see they um they're nice they're nice Loves it. yeah are you licking it They're nice. How about you, Daph? Is you enjoying it? Yeah, you like? You like? Yeah, yummy. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah, so they're having a little... little treat. A little ice treat. So... They can go back in the freezer. Joe's washed up the bowl that his mix was in, yeah. which now means can I can start on my Ghirardelli Hi. chocolate brownies. That's if I can get these back in the freezer without dropping everything. He's trying hard. There we go. There we go. That's in. So yeah, so I'm going to make some brownies and see how they turn out. Pretzels are looking good, I've got to admit, so. And I don't know if you saw, but he did add the salt on as well. Yeah, I put the salt on. So, tasty. So, all done, out of the oven. And I think they look quite good. Like, they, they look all right. I mean, they're quite hot still, but. Look yeah. at that. They're cute. Little they're nice and soft. Little Mickey pretzels. Can't wait to try one. Get dunks like breadsticks in it, is it? Basically, it's just some bread. Um, yeah, just try it with some cheese sauce and enjoy them. So, well done, Joe. Will Jen. you eat one? Yeah, I'll try one. Well, I might not eat a whole one. Yeah. But I'll try one. Okay. Right, well, I'm going to let you uh, crack on. Sorry for taking up your space. I'll uh, <laughs> be with a nice clean Oh, mine's literally going to take minutes. Clean work area. There you go. Not hours. <laughs> okay, so mine should be a lot easier because it's literally this so similar to joe it was just like a pre-mix in a box there was like four or five of these sachets in the box um didn't bring the whole one just brought the one mix but mine's simple you just add a few ingredients mix it up throw it in the oven simples so like a blue peter presenter I've already measured out this isn't wine. It could, so it, looks, wine. it could be wine, but it's not wine. But yeah, I've already measured out what I need, which is basically water, vegetable oil, and an egg. Add that in a bowl, mix it up, add the mix, mix that up, stick it in a pan, throw it in the oven. Jobs are good in. 75 mils of water. Water, should I say. In you the bowl. Water. 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 75 mils of vegetable oil, not wine. In the bowl. 
and a trusty egg. Now this is where I've got to try and crack it without getting any shell. Wish me luck. Good to go. No egg. So it's just a case now of mixing it up. Got my whisk. Here it goes. right I'm not going to be using the spatula I'm dropping it everywhere oh dear Joe's gonna kill me literally <laughs> oops hands clean I'm just gonna wipe the floor done so it needs to go in the oven for 45 to 50 minutes. That's quite a long time. But hey, there you go. Let's get it in the oven. All done. Ready to go in the oven. The oven is preheated. So I'm just gonna one-handed open up the oven and pop in the creation looks good it smells smell good. good it smells good right there we go in so 45 to 50 minutes so we'll see how that's going so it's half seven it's about quarter past eight you got a little uh is it gone someone's been licking the spoon someone's been licking the bowl right i'll do blue, blue peter and um here's a Here's one I made earlier. So, brownies are out of the oven. I think they're cooked. It's still a little bit wobbly. I'll show you. I mean, it looks okay, but it is a little bit wobbly, but it does say to... Um, it should set. It'll set. Set, let it cool down and it should set. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I'm just cooking tea, nothing special. I have some hot dogs, so I'm just frying off some onions. Joe's drinking his wine. You're also drinking my wine. I'm drinking Joe's it's wine. It's not oil this time, is it? It's not oil. This is not oil. This is, this is, yeah, just a little tipple. Um, so yeah, so that's what we're doing. And then, we we'll watch Love, Love Island, Love Island's on. And then we're gonna walk the dogs. Um, just before bed. If anyone's watching, I wonder what my noise is. It's um, Encanto. Encanto. I need to stir me onions. Bear with. Um, yeah, so. If you had to have a magical gift, what would it be? If I had to have a magical gift? Yeah. Like a magical power. Um, Sorry, you need to talk over this because otherwise you I know, yeah, copyright, copyright, blah, 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 blah. I don't know what my magical gift would be. No. I don't, I don't really know. Mine would just to be. I'd just have endless money. Endless money. Every, just, time, every yeah. time I sneezed, like 50, 60 quid just come out, you know? Oh, there you go. That one would be cool. I then. just wish for high hay fever all the time. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Although, we both suffer with hay fever, but we mm. haven't um, actually had. I'm going to mute the TV because trying to talk over that. Quite loud. It's quite loud. Um, just mute it. Let's mute it. There we I'll go. Pause it Oh, he's watching in Canto. Um, I thought, was, yeah, so we both have hay fever, but actually down here in New not Forest, it's not been too bad. And this is like peak season for, for me anyway, and, and you. Um, and before we came down here, we were having a couple of days where it was quite bad. Last weekend was really bad. Uh -huh. Yeah, so, yeah. but actually on that, I'm going to give a top tip. If any of you suffer with hay fever, I'm not paid for this, but 
Fees. Nuage. Nuage? Hay huh? fever, relief wipes. Now you can get Kleenex ones. Um, new what? New, new, yeah, new, new age. Could be new age. Could be new age. We're just trying to be posh. New age. Um, new age. But yeah, we got these on Amazon. Three packs of thirty for four quid. Um, but I have seen in Tesco, favorite place, other supermarkets are available. That um, they Kleenex do like these. They're basically like wet wipes. Um, and if you wipe your face and all that sort of thing, um, it helps relieve hay fever symptoms. Um, it collects all the pollen that kind of catches on your face and anything like that. So um, I've used them for the first time this year and touch wood, I'd highly recommend. So if you suffer with hay fever, then I would give them a go if you've not already. Um, if any of you suffer with hay fever and you have some top tips, add them in the comments. Yeah, Let me know. Sure. Let me know, because we're always trying to find new ways of um, getting rid of hay fever. We've even considered the jabs, but ooh, who knows? But yeah, let us know. Anyway, I've got my wine. My onions are cooking nicely. My brownies are sunk. Is that a good sign? Are they meant to do that? Careful, it could be hot. Ah, uh, yeah, I think that's right. They always look a bit like crumbly, don't they? On the top. Yeah, they crack a little they bit. They crack a bit. Um, yeah, so, got me wine, onions cooking, hot dogs are heating up. Ready for Love Island. Dinner is served. Mm -hmm. Me hot dogs. Your what? Me hot dogs. Got me hot dogs, then I. Not you. Not you, girls. Not you. Um, so yeah, we're going to um, tuck in, watch a bit of Love Island, and then we'll catch up with you after when we take the doggies for a walk. See you in a bit. We've eaten. Love Island yeah. is on, but we're going to watch it on plus one. So we're going to take the doggies for a walk. Yeah, need a quick break. Aren't we girls? Yeah. Get the leads on them. Oh. Yeah. oh. I have the dogs. Don't let them go down there. Down where? Oh, because of the bread. Bread for the birdies. Where's daddy going, girls? Where's daddy going? Where's he going? Huh? Where is he going? Is he going inside? We were literally just saying how quiet it is. You could almost hear a pin drop. Yep. It's very, very There's the odd dog bark in the distance. Like that. But it is very quiet. They're having it. They're loving it. There are people here, obviously. So we've made it back to the kind of main entrance. Now we're going to do the field. We're not going to do the dog agility tonight. I'm not going to look inside the camera. Oh, but I want one. If anyone wants to buy me one, yeah, feel free. Feel free. <laughs> or like even the deposit. <laughs> we can afford the monthly payment. <laughs> yeah. It's just like 30, 40 grand. Mm, not quite. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Kind of walking on the stones, making loads of noise. Yeah, little treats. Oh, delicious. Good girl. Oh, little yeah. treats. Good. They're nice. Good. Yeah. yeah. Come yeah. on in. Come on in. Come on in. Come on down. 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 Listen, listen, look, use your panty. <laughs> Nearly. Oh, you want your treat? You want your treat? Get him then, get him. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm not running that far now. <laughs> yeah, you run back to me. <laughs> Hello. 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 <laughs> Good girl. Hi. Good girl. Hi. Da. Good girl. What's this, Peg? What's this? Good What's this? Good girl. What's this? What is it? Should we go back home? Should we go back to the caravan? Should we carry on with all it is? Come on. Come on then. You can smell the bread. <laughs> <laughs> Joe threw out some bread for the birds. Daphne saw him do it. And they do. <laughs> and now she's like, come on. No, you're not eating bread. That's not for you. That's for the birdies. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. So there we go. We're back. The girls are just uh, yeah, having a drink, drink. Good girl, Bubba's. Yeah, good girl. And you, Peg? Yeah, nice. That's it. Drip it everywhere, Da. Drip it everywhere. We are back. Joe's playing with my brownie. Yeah. Is it done? I don't know. <laughs> Could you imagine? What would you do if I did? I wouldn't be happy. Because I actually want to eat it. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Um, so there you go. That's today. Done. Um, I might do some Lego, but that will be in a separate vlog. Yeah, Joe will do some Lego. We will put some Lego because he's got the big Harry Potter set to build. We will put that in because I know a few of you have said how much you've enjoyed <laughs> watching Joe build his Lego. Yeah, I might talk a bit more through it. So. Much to my, you know, me. <laughs> <gasps> and Joe has a birthday coming up soon. Yeah. So if anybody want to send us any uh us. <laughs> don't need to send me any, any Lego. Lego. Don't waste your time, don't waste the postage. <clears throat> um but yeah. But if you enjoyed this vlog, then please, 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 please give it the thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button as well. Yes. Hit subscribe. Those please help us grow the channel and if you've got any questions or if there's anything you want to ask us add, a add it in the comments yeah that's what you need to do that's if you're even watching if you are watching this one thank you so much i'm glad we haven't bored you um but i bore myself sometimes he bores me sometimes i'm only joking um but there you go that's it for today so we will see you next time for our next vlog here at hoburn mm -hmm. But for now, it's adios for me. Cheerio. Bye. Bye.